Hello and welcome to another how-to series by Stomacher. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Gantt chart in Excel from scratch. There are four ways to create a Gantt chart in Excel. We can use charts, formulas, pivot table, and we can use Excel templates. Let's start with the first method, charts. First, we have to enter the necessary data of the project. These include tasks, start dates, end dates, and durations. Let's write down each task. Let's enter start and end date. Now we can calculate the duration of each task. To actually start building the chart, we have to highlight start dates, click on insert, then click insert column. Now we're going to choose the stack bar. Now we want to include the duration data in the chart. So let's right click on the chart itself, then click select data, click on add. Now we have to type duration in the series name section, or we can just click on the column itself. Now we can select the data located in the duration column. Now we want to get rid of our start date data. Let's click on start date, right click, format data series, click on the fill and line button, let's click on fill. We can select no fill here. Also we want to add tasks to our chart. Select data. Click on edit here. Now we can select all the tasks. Next, we want to flip these tasks as they are not in correct order. As you see, our first task is market research, and here is the last one. Let's right click on the task and select categories in reverse order. We can adjust the date range according to our start and end date. All we have to do is to take our earliest and latest date and change the formatting to general. Now let's click on the date range and click on access options. Now we can write these values to minimum and maximum. So there you have it. We've created a gun chart using charts method. Let's continue with the second method, formulas. Similar to any way you create a Gantt chart, we have to enter the necessary data first. Now let's create a date range for our chart. Now let's modify the borders. To create the chart, we have to select the cells in which we want to place the gun chart. Then click conditional formatting and click new rule. Here we use the end function to add the duration bars. Let's set this date greater than or equal to the start date. This date less than or equal to the end date. Let's 
Let's click on format so we can choose the color of the bars. Of course, you can customize the colors of the cells if you want. And that's how we create a Gantt chart using formulas. Let's continue with the third method, pivot table. Like all the other methods, we have to enter necessary data first. Let's select all our data and click on pivot table. Let's click on insert then pivot table. Now we have to drag task to rows and start the iteration to values. Now let's right click on count of start date. Let's go to summarize values by and click on sum. Now we have to change the number format. Let's click on date and OK. Now we can add the chart to our table. Let's click on insert, insert column or bar chart, and we're going to select stacked bar. Now we have to remove the start dates, right click, then let's click on fill, and we can get rid of the start date. As you see, the tasks are not in correct order. So let's click on task, then more sort options. Click on descending and sum of start date. We can adjust the date range of the table according to our start and end date. So we have to take our earliest and latest date, change the formatting. Let's click on the date range on the table, format axis. We can change the minimum and maximum values. And that's how we create a gun chart using pivot table. Now let's continue with the fourth method, Excel templates. These are ready to use Excel templates designed by experts. They can be downloaded from third parties. If you don't have the time to create a gun chart in Excel or simply want the best version out there, you can download Somekas gun chart maker for free. Just go to Somekas website Search for Gantt chart, click on Gantt chart Excel template, and you can download the template for free by clicking the download button. Thanks for watching.